Hey everybody, it's Matt here and today I've got the Epson TMT823L which I'm going to be using with one of the square registers and I thought today I would show you how to change the paper in this. Now, this thermal printer comes with one of these little rolls. That's probably not going to last very long. Fortunately, Square has been moving towards doing a lot of SMS and email receipts, so that can save you on paper. But for customers that want a printed one, um, this paper roll that comes with the printer is not going to last long. It supports 80 by 80 millimeter rolls, so you'll probably want to look at getting something like this uh, to put in the printer when you've run out of your little standard roll. First up, make sure that you remove anything that's holding the paper closed. These rolls that I've got here, they don't have anything holding them uh, sealed, but this one that's come with the printer does. It has a little bit of tape there. So I'm just gonna remove that because we don't want that. That's gonna cause us problems with the printer. And then to put it in, we basically want to grab this little tab here and pull up and that'll lift up the top cover. So again, it's just thumb on that lip, lift it and it'll come up. You should feel the click. Now, for putting the paper in, you wanna have the roll in that direction. So the paper is coming out from underneath it. And then it's really straightforward. Just hold it outside the printer, drop the roll in and close it. And that's it. Uh, you should now have a new roll of paper in your receipt printer. The printer will actually hold the paper at that point. And if we put some power into our printer and turn it on with that power button on the front there, we should now be able to feed that paper through perfectly fine and tear it off and we're good to go. Connect that up to our POS or TEAL, in this case, the square register, and we can start printing receipts. So I hope you found this video helpful. Be sure to like it and also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this from me. Bye for now.